Are you having a hard time getting your Kindle to turn on? Don't worry, we know what you need to do in order to get your e-reader up and running in no time. Make sure to check out all the steps that I mentioned in this video and I'm sure that you will find the right fix to turn your Kindle back on from its slumber. All Kindles are battery powered and even if they stay powered on for weeks, they do require occasional charging to sustain the battery. So if you have trouble getting your Kindle to turn on, make sure that it's fully charged first. On newer Kindle models, a battery low indicator with a battery and a plug-in sign appears on the screen once it's low on power. A battery caution indicator can also arise from dead batteries and it can also indicate various other issues. Nonetheless, plug in your Kindle to charge for a whole day before turning it on. Charging it overnight should also suffice. If you still can't get the battery to charge, check if the power supply and the cables are in good condition. Wear and tear, rust and bends can all mess up the power supply. If you find any such issues with the cable, immediately replace it with a new one, preferably from a reputed brand. You should also take a look at the power outlet for any power related issues. Check if the outlet is outputting optimal voltage to power connected devices. If you notice any red flags, switch to a different power outlet and try charging a Kindle. The Kindle should light an amber LED to indicate that it's charging. Now, if the battery is working properly and you still can't get your Kindle to turn on or if it seems to be stuck on the loading screen, try restarting the device. All you have to do is to press and hold the power button for about 40 seconds. If that doesn't work, press and hold the button for a couple more minutes. The Kindle should restart and show a loading screen if done right. If your Kindle still won't turn on after restarting the device, Try plugging it to a PC. When connecting your Kindle to a PC, unlike restarting the device, the Kindle comes to life in response to the connection. All you need to do is to plug in your Kindle to your PC using a USB cable. Wait for a few minutes and your Kindle should respond. Now, if you can't get your Kindle to turn on even after following all the steps that I mentioned so far, Chances are that the battery of your Kindle might be dead. You will have to get it checked and replaced. You can perform a battery reset on your own, but doing it is a difficult task. Instead, I recommend that you contact Amazon and get your battery replaced, especially if it's still under warranty. Just be wary that this is an issue that's common across all Kindle devices, especially ones that have been sitting with little to no battery for a long time. And with that, I believe that I've touched on everything I wanted to talk about on fixing your Kindle that's not turning on. If you found this video useful, do comment your thoughts below, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Kindle content.